our main man Richie, my wingman Goose. It's his birthday on Wednesday. Richie is going to be the big old 50. Five zero years. He's managed to survive so far on his planet. So we're going to put a few little clips together um, as a little birthday message for you, Rich. I hope you have a good day, mate, on Wednesday. Um, I know you've got some cracking presents off your wife, because um, guess who had to get them for her? I know you're going to like them. Um, I know you've been looking at um, trying to sort a second GoPro to go on the bike. Um, hence the one I found online. And you keep messaging me about saying, as the guy replied, as the guy replied, the guy has replied, but the reason I can't follow up this guy with a GoPro, we've already got your second GoPro, so um, at the minute, I'm just bullshitting you with the messages about this GoPro, so just bear with me, mate, because <laughs> you've got one. And if you keep getting on about it tomorrow at work, I think I might have to banjo you. She's done you good, mate, she's got you some good stuff. I'm not going to say too much on it. Well, actually, it don't really matter what I say to you about these presents because this video ain't going to come out until after your birthday. So, see if you're pleased or not, mate. We've got some Cardo Scala Rider Pack Talks. So, we've got some proper intercoms, mate. Um, we've got this DMC mesh we can have a play with. Um, and hopefully, have some. Um, decent conversation. We did look at the other uh, top brands of intercoms but everything we was reading, all the reviews, how they were set up, how they work, everything kept coming back to the Cardo, the pack talk. And he ain't shut up about it since what, June, July, when we were speaking with your good wife Sam and she was asking what you want for your birthday. It was something I was looking at so I said why don't we purchase what he's asked for and guess what buddy you've got one but it would be good to try out these uh, voice commands as well I wonder if they wonder how good they pick up black country I've heard a few people say to get them working correctly uh, you have to try and talk with a bit of an American accent so I better start practicing but anyway, Rich, uh, happy birthday for Wednesday, mate. Um, we're going to have a couple of little pictures coming up in this video of Gooseman and his big 5-0, you old git. Hi, Rich. Welcome to the 50 Club, you pussyfoot. Hi, Rich. Happy birthday, you old git. Right. So today is the big day for the main mangoose. Happy birthday, mate. Uh, 50 today. You've made it. How? I don't know. But you're here, you've made it. 50 years old. So, hope you're having a good day, mate. Uh, we've got a few things planned at work for you. Got a few prezzies uh, lined up. Um, I've got a few prezzies in the back of the car as well for you, so um, a few more to add to you, Paul. I know you opened um, a load last night off your good wife, um, hence the messages you sent me about... Well, I could tell in the message how excited you was. I've got a Cardo pack talk. I've got a new GoPro. So... Well deserved mate, you deserve it, you've done enough to help everybody, so uh, hope you have a good day mate. Um, I've been getting a few things together, a few clips, a few photos, a few messages off the guys, so um, here's your best bits. I've got to have a disciplinary here. And then I says, oh, and then somebody come in and disturb us saying, you've been out to me about the telephone man's coming. Then they took me into the community room, the local lo 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 teachers in there, and like surprise with all balloons and the cake. And... Yeah. Mm. 
The balloons are all on the floor in my office where I am now. I'm everywhere. We, we hide them then. It's a good day. I've time to blow them up, did I? Ah, oh, nearly went in there this morning, no? My. Oh, it will never know. USB, it's in bed. Come on, boy. I'm gonna be jealous. Put down you. You put um, a power bank in here. Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> That's good. Okay then, Richie. We your Budweiser and your motor rev T-shirt on. Number one. Present one. <clears throat> what is it? Do you need your glasses? I don't know what it is. Let's see you. Oh, yeah. I need one of them, actually. Put on my bike here. Yeah. Craig's, this dead man. Craig's been up in your head. No. Got a gift show. No, this is you. No, you won't. Yeah, I could do it. Yes, sir. Now swearing, please. We're live. Don't swear. We're live in the jungle. Kid. Number three, all wrapped up lovely. Take your time, Rich. Make it last. Oh, oh yes. Um, Have a look. Oh, grips. Want to rub us out? Keep my hands nice and warm. Very good. Number f oh. uh, four. Number four. Dating card just for your bloody Poundland stuff, did ya? Disrespecting me. I don't know what this is. I think this is mess. I ain't gonna say anything. You don't have a fucking side. Yes. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's set. What's that then? All the accessories, eh? The GoPro. The cameras. That's yes. for when you get them then. Well, these are way for the ones I've got anyway. What number was that? Very easy. Right. And back. Oh yeah, I'm going to do with that as well. Spoiled. Spoiled, yeah, that's a good one actually. Yes. Yes. Oh, it is getting so excited. It's beautiful. Hold up. Number six. Got a bad frog. Take your menthol that I brought you. No excuses for feeling unwell. I bought your menthol, I bought your honey, I bought your revels. Green wrapped up good. Pass the parcel. More because the man loves mow the rail. <laughs> How did you get? How did you get that? Is that the one off? I don't know. Can I get it? I'll be paid it. <laughs> Cheeky sir. It's a camera. Of a GoPro. So I did. <laughs> I'd have to put that one there. You don't know what they are. No. What's that? Oh, I'll extend the one for that. Good. Number one. Good uh, presents. Okay. Yeah. Sorted. And your last one. Okay. Your spot. Do you have Is it the duo one now? I don't know. Buy 
café. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, 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 he's coming in for it. He's coming in for it. Cheers. Cheers. That's good to present. You're welcome. You Thank know you. what? I'd just like to say this man is a wonderful man and he deserves everything that he gets. And I hope he has a lovely birthday. My soulmate and my hubby for life. You know, I stop going more than once every year, do you? No, I don't. I'm not joking, I'm joking. You're from the first one. Yeah, no, from the still there. Yeah, no, man. Have to get rid of it. Got a couple of friends there, are you? It's got four mates, I'm out of rest there. It's okay, I got the bike. I don't have to go out with her, though. You got friends, now are you, Rich? So a wonderful husband. Fifty today. There's a few of my presents, I just thought I'd show everybody, some new pumps, t-shirt, some aftershave, a new iPad off the wife, a big one, some beer, chocolates, heated vest off Julie, USB, new GoPro off the wife and battery, more mounts, wife off the grandkids and Tom, Drift battery of Craig, thanks. New lock, hot grips, USB off the wife as well. Pack talk off the wife as well. And tank bag. And quite a bit of money to spend on bike stuff. Awesome. Thank you, everybody. And put the hoodie on and I'll, I'll switch it off for Pull over, I thought it was an hoodie. <laughs> huh? So you says pull over, I says I thought you says it was an hoodie. Warm the suit up. Alright, mate. That will not dent, you miserable old. Oh, oh. Start. Camping. Three pound per pitch there. There's nothing there at all by yeah. the looks of it. Probably had to shit in a ditch or something. Oh, I thought that was a deer then. It's a dog. So I had my eyes out. We'll have that many cameras, we'll have every angle uh -huh. covered. We'll have a job with Steven Spielberg. Well, I'm feeling of an itch. Right on my chin chin latte. Oh, say so the, so the company to you, Rich. I know, I've got that, um, what is it, a scent. <laughs> I love it. Meet at mine, up in the uh, top, down the pool, a few beers. Oi. Fire on, log roast, spit roast. <laughs> now, this dog, oh. it's about, kept barking all the while. I googled to her, oh. and there was a little piece on there saying if you get a little bit of petrol, only like a capful, put it in the dog's food. Uh -huh. Stopped and barked. I've got this little cab petrol, put it in the, the dog food, come back and was watching through the bedroom window. The dog comes out after about 15 minutes of me waiting about like. And then he goes he goes up to the dog food, sniffs at you, I thought he ain't gonna have that. All of a sudden he eats it. Then about five minutes later, he starts running around the garden. Never seen nothing like it, like oh, man, like a rocket. All of a sudden stopped on its bag, back, legs in the air. Oh you're joking, you ain't kidding, did ya? Nah, it ran out of petrol. <laughs> <laughs> Your bell ends. <laughs> Steve's polished his bell, I think, by the look of it. He's what? He's polished his bell. Oh, nice and shiny bell. John Green, you plonk. Do you want the job in front or what? 
They're meeting your pumpkin by a cutted freak, another dumb and dumber clown. <laughs> <laughs> dumb and dumber, huh? you can't beat it. I love dumb and dumber. And deliverance again. You know, um, you know Darwin. Darwin, who the hell? Darwin's theory. I think we might have to go up here and turn around because I'm left here. You know Darwin. Darwin. Oh, you know about evolution. No, oh, no, I don't. I'm not sure about that. I'll, I'll continue with that conversation then. Go on, I'm intrigued now. I want to know about the Darwins. But his daughter's buried there. In that graveyard. He's bored the shit out of me now. I oh, no. I thought I was talking to somebody intelligent, but um, it's my fault I got it wrong. Mm -hmm. They obviously don't work in a school. Aye? They obviously don't work in a school. No. We don't work in school, but it's turn up. There's a knob jockey going. Turn around you, here at the bottom. You're going, oh, you're going there. Uh, you're coming back up this way, though? Yeah. I'll wait here for you then. Oh, here's a sorty van. Oh. An hand's just popped out. It's, it's sooty naked. <laughs> 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 He's having a bath. <laughs> Sooty's had a shave. Yeah. No. Yeah, you can come on one of these roads, talk about Darwin with Rich. Ah, oh, love Darwin, whatever that is. Yeah. Darwin, Darwin. Darwin is silly, you got a word of Darwin, hey. Charles Darwin. Who? Charles Darwin. I thought that was Charles Dickens. Nah. I've got no hope, have I? The doctor says, you know what I'm going to have to do, don't you? I said, I'm going to have to check it internally, because I was like, I've got piles to, to cut a long story short. Oh. And, um... He says, get on the desk, on the desk. <laughs> that was the wrong, that was the get wrong, that was the wrong visit. <laughs> no, he says, get on the desk, <laughs> edit, edit that one. He says, <laughs> that was the dentist. <laughs> he says, uh, oh, I nearly crashed then. He says, get on the, he says, get on the couch or whatever you call it. <laughs> get him wet. And he says, oh yeah. <laughs> get on the couch. <laughs> you know, the doctor's, oh, oh God. Well, oh, start again. Well, he says, get on the bed. That's better. Yeah. And, um, <laughs> get in the bed. <laughs> he says, put your knees up. I had a joke. He says, put your knees up to your chest. And then anybody who's listening, who listens to this, don't know what I'm on about. <laughs> he says, put your knees up to your right, right, right up. And I thought, care of me. So anyway, the rubber glove goes on. And I said, he puts his finger up my backside, right? Oh. And my legs straightened. Literally the strout and then he went, is that uncomfortable? I went, oh, I says, yeah, I says, is that a ring on your finger? I says, no, it's my watch. <laughs> <laughs> it's working. It should be on because I've turned it on. We well, can see the front, it's on, see? <laughs> You haven't got longer arms, have you? I've got that. Now I've got it good, but the only oh, trouble yeah. is that bungee's come out. That's for a contraption. It's the washing line. <laughs> <laughs> Where is it? Zip wire, zip wire that is. It's it's nice, it's it now. What the fuck is it doing? It's got it. Do you know yours is like a ghost? Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's got his hands. That's <laughs> good. There you oh. go. <laughs> Looks like you're still in it, Rich. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
comes off the end of there, that's what's good. Kettle. Kettle. It's a good look, that is, though, which you watch trying to do red levers. Yeah. The extra room is having motorcycling. That's it. Oh, coming. We go from summer to Arctic. I ain't getting wet today. Well, that is actually. Let's say no low battery. Today the map cycle show.